Hi, this is Chris Webb with Youth Social Marketing and Consulting, and today I'm just going to go through the uh, browser of Google Chrome. So I'm going to actually minimize this browser here just a moment. These are all my Google Chrome browsers that I have, and you can have default browsers for uh, many different things. I work with a real estate team here in Tucson, so this is our default browser right here. And the good thing about having multiple browsers is that for some of the internet lead generation that we do we have all of these bookmarks that I've saved on here and you can see that they're opening all of them right away so what I want to do is just kinda go through a little bit of the Google Chrome browser and how it works from here basically so you can see that it's automatically gonna come up with your with your background that you choose and if you want to learn how, where to choose that um, go ahead and watch one of our other videos on how to choose your Google Chrome uh, background. So the other thing here is it comes up with a multiple of uh, different types of websites that you've been viewing recently. There's other things that it does is it still has your bookmark site up here, yet it says apps over here. So if you were in Google Chrome before and you had and you saved multiple apps to your background, that's where they're going to appear. And then if I'm just going to go back, so we go back to our regular Chrome with nothing up here. The other thing is all the Google apps are right here. So you have your Google Plus, your Search, YouTube, News, Play, Maps, Gmail, Drive, Calendar. One thing that's not here is Blogger. Well, if you just click the More down here, there it is. Photos, Finance, Wallet, Shopping, Offers, Books, Translate. And you can get to the even more Google screen, which used to be up on top here. And then some of you may recognize this screen here. So this goes to multiple apps that Google has for you. So one other thing I wanted to show you is when you were back in the previous to the new upgrade that Google did where they put all of the things kind of up here, and you had these apps on your screen, a lot of times you had multiple apps and you saw it just barely as I as I changed it over but there is still an arrow key to get over here and you can see that down here are the apps if you were to add apps you can add the, them through the app store one other thing is I have some extensions on mine and that would be seen right through here so you can see some of this, the extensions that I had there again this is Chris Webb with you social marketing and consulting if you have any questions please send me an email Chris at usocialmarketing.com. Again, that's Chris at usocialmarketing.com, and I'll talk to you at that point. Thank you guys. If, you, if this video helped you, go ahead and hit the